with the reports from the United States suggesting that 3D printing of homes can now incorporate hemp into their concrete to provide them added levels of insulation and fire retardation. And I ask, one, given that 3D homes can be printed in a matter of days by a small number of highly skilled technicians at approximately 85% of the cost of a regular build, is the Department of Housing considering 3D printing as a means to increase its available housing stock? Two, if yes to one, is hemp being considered as an additive to any such build? Three, if no to one, why not? And four, if no to two, are there any legislative hurdles that would need to be cleared before hemp could be used as a concrete additive here in WA? Minister for Agriculture. Thank you, President. I thank the members for notice of the question. The following answer has been provided by the Minister for Housing. One to four, the Department of Communities utilises a range of innovative and flexible methods for boosting social housing across the state, including modular and prefabricated construction, timber frame construction and spot purchasing. Communities requires new builds to be compliant with the National Construction Code's energy efficiency and accessibility provisions, but considers a range of construction methods and is, op and is open to innovative delivery methods. Communities has an open and ongoing call for submissions process that builders and developers can access at any time to have their products considered for future social housing delivery. 